Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, back to NXT. I am Travis Bailey. Last week, in the inaugural episode, we had one hell of a card. We had Mr. Zebra Man taking on Blake Evans, who ended up getting the victory there. And then CM Puma took on Tamoa Mamula, but Muffy E ended up interfering in that match, costing CM Puma the win. And we will hear from him later tonight. Let's get right into our matchups for this evening. We have Kevin Anderson taking on Drew Niedermeyer. The man is huge. And then following that, we have Jason Jones and taking on Xander Black. So let's get started for this evening. We have Xander Black backstage with a microphone. Wow, while wow, Xander Black is on a mission here in NXT, he is setting his eyes and his goals very high. Good for him. But here we are, starting off our first matchup of the evening. Making his way to the ring is Kevin Anderson. You see that money equals power. The man is a beast in the ring, very technical, and he has the ability to just turn the tides on anybody he is facing in that ring as he panders to the crowd and jumping up onto the onto the ring apron there we are in the NXT arena as the fans they're going wild for Kevin Anderson now last week as I said our champion Muffy E came down to ringside and just distracted CM Puma and then made his way into the ring and attacked him not not a very good thing for our champion to do but we see here Drew Niedermeyer coming down to the ring just look at the size of this man the tattoos on his arms are bigger than my head for crying out loud and he is looking to start off his career here in NXT with a win and trying to completely destroy Kevin Anderson, who's not even stepping out of the ring, showing him no respect. Oh my gosh. My gosh. Fire shooting out of the corners there for his entrance. Wow. Well, folks, let's get this match underway. We see Niedermeyer stretching out there on the ropes. Come on, ref. Ring that bell. And here we go. They're going to start off center of the ring. He's got him in a headlock. Spinning him around, tossing him into the corner. Oh, almost going for that clothesline there. But Anderson backs out of the way just in time. Back to the headlock now from behind. Oh, my God. That was a very quick, very quick German suplex for such a guy who's so big. That was a very, very fast move. Now with the arm is Niedermeyer. Picking him up. Stalling for just a second and bringing him face first down onto the mat. He is holding his face, but Anderson jumps right back up, gets to the headlock. And now from behind and again with that very quick German suplex. That is surprising to see from someone who's so big. Do, do a move that is very quick. Um, it is a move mostly used by powerful, powerful wrestlers, but he mixes the speed and the strength together very well. So Anderson now, what's he doing? He's going to toss him over the rope. No, bringing him back hard with a clothesline. My God. Drop a Niedermeyer hard onto the mat and an elbow to the face to finish it off. Sending him into the corner now. 
hard, hard shots over and over. He's going to put him into the tree of woe. What's he going to do here? Oh, he's jumping to the outside. Going to the top. Oh, my God. Jumping right onto the chest of Niedermeyer. You got to keep the big man grounded. And jumping on his chest is going to do just that. You, you work on that head. You work on that upper body. Because that is where his, most of his strength is coming from. Jeez. And this as I say that. He destroys Anderson with a clothesline and then drops him hard onto his head. With that clo with that DDT, excuse me. Now into a headlock. Picking him up. Dropping him hard onto the back. Now both of these men, we're in our NXT tournament. Uh, I believe Muffy E took on Niedermeyer, and we knew how that ends. And uh, Kevin Anderson faced off against Blake Evans. Blake Evans getting the win there. So... Kevin Anderson now looking to redeem himself from that NXT tournament, as is Niedermeyer. Both men eliminated from the first round. Not, not a very good way to start off their careers here in NXT. Niedermeyer taking the top off of our announce table here, but then tossing him right back into the ring. Doesn't look like he's going to use the announce table. Oh, man. 300-pound leg drop right across the throat of Kevin Anderson. And now he slides back into the ring. And Anderson trying to get away, but eats all of that clothesline. And then a big knee right into the face. My gosh. Drew Niedermeyer is just putting the screws to Kevin Anderson. Oh, into the camel clutch. Anderson now, he's crawling, but he gives up on that. Stands up. Look at the power of Kevin Anderson. That is a 300-pound behemoth he had on his back. And he picks him right up. Elbow to the face. Back into the corner it looks like it goes no bouncing off the ropes tilt a whirl side slam of the man that is so big dropping down on the on the arm now what a move by kevin anderson you got to give it to him and a very nice very nice drop kick to boot the man is strong he's quick he is really doing what he's got to do to keep niedermeyer off of him and keep him away from him that is the key there keeping him grounded keeping him tight and just get off me says Kevin Anderson it right into the ropes and then back into a headlock European uppercut grounding him Niedermeyer finally pushing him away and hitting him with a DDT big move you see Anderson just laying there Niedermeyer now picking him up and he's gonna toss him bringing him right back into a power slam you have that huge body dropping right across your chest cannot feel good Anderson is dazed now and Niedermeyer's going to toss him right over the top rope. Maybe go back to that announce table. Out here on the outside is not good. Anderson reverses it. Very wise. Very nice. Keeping him away from that announce table is going to be the surefire way that you don't get put through it. Body slam now. And Anderson holding that head. Oh, man. That is a patented move by Kevin Anderson. Hitting them with that spine buster if Anderson I was just gonna say wants to win this match he's got to get it back into the ring but Niedermeyer uses the steps and tosses Anderson into those steps and then now into the post my god breaking him wide open Anderson is bleeding this is not good for Kevin Anderson and now Niedermeyer taking his time getting into the ring he knows he's got some time that he can do a little bit and uh Kevin Anderson is really, really in bad shape. Oh, he just went face first right onto those steel steps, folks. Already bleeding. Head is already damaged. Anderson really has got to get control of this matchup. He tosses Niedermeyer hard into the ring. Oh, nice reversal there by Kevin Anderson. What's he going to do here? Going over. Niedermeyer reverses it. He's just too strong. He has the clear advantage in this matchup. And... Oh my gosh. Look at these. Jeez. Hard, hard forearms across the body. Picking him up now. Oh my god. Snapmare DDT out of nowhere. Kevin Anderson hits Drew Niedermeyer with that snapmare. One, two, three. That is it, folks. I can't believe that. Kevin Anderson dominate, getting dominated most of this matchup. Comes out of nowhere with a snapmare DDT and gets the win. Wow. What a matchup there. Folks, we will be right back after this commercial from NGC.
Welcome back, folks. Well, it looks like Muffy E has got some serious, serious issues with CM Puma. We will see how those play out in the coming weeks. But our next matchup is Jason Jones. He is from the island of Jamaica, coming down to the ring in his black and white. He is going to be facing off against the man that we saw earlier this evening, Xander Black. Now, Xander Black is from the United Kingdom, and he is coming in here to show what he can do. He was eliminated in that first round of the NXT tournament by Blake Evans. So a lot of the guys that we have seen so far have been eliminated in the first round. Some of the people um, who have advanced, they're getting a little bit of rest. Now, Tamoa and Jason Jones were not in our tournaments. Tamoa making his debut last week. Jason Jones making his debut this week. So, Xander Black, CM Puma, Blake Evans, Drew Niedermeyer, Kevin Anderson, all of these guys, Mr. Zebraman, have were eliminated from this tournament. First or second round. Now, Zebraman actually made it to the end facing off against Muffy E. And we know that Muffy E has won and is our global champion. Now, these two men are in the ring. Xander Black wearing his United Kingdom Union Jack cape. This match is now underway. Meeting into the center of the ring. My God, Jason Jones just starts the battle off with a huge clothesline. And then a neck breaker. Oh, man, he bounced right off the shoulder of Xander Black. My gosh. Now from behind goes Black. Both men in... Oh, wow. Both men in black and white. Xander Black in the short, short trunks. And, oh, wow. He is really using that crossroads over and over to try to damage Jason Jones, who is in, with the dreadlocks there. Oh, picking him up high and then slamming him with that European uppercut. That's a hell of a move. You got to be pretty strong to get any superstar up like that. Bringing him back. Oh, Jason Jones reverses with a belly to belly. Grabbing now Black by the head. And what he's going to do the same. Oh. Folks, I have no words. What a tremendous kick by Jason Jones. Right across the chest. And now across the back of Xander Black. It's, it looks like Black's going to have to watch out for those lethal legs of Jason Jones. My goodness. And now dropping him right onto his head. You see him standing up immediately, but he is holding the back of that head. Jason Jones tossing him into that corner face first. Oh, he's setting him up top. He's going for something big, folks. He's grabbing him, pulling him back, dropping him hard onto the mat right across that head. Jones, oh, nice reversal by Xander. And he goes for a neck breaker of his own, jumping into the air and dropping him hard onto the mat. Tossing him into the corner now. He just lets him get out. Xander Black with a kick to the stomach. Oh, flipping over, dropping him hard, hard onto his head. These gentlemen are both attacking the heads of their opponents. There's a third crossroads from Xander Black. And he is going at it, folks. He is just wailing away at the head of Jason Jones. And it looks like uh, neither one of these gentlemen have the upper hand. They are trading shots back and forth. Whoa! What a move by Xander Black jumping all the way across the ring with that lion salt. And now they're battling it out punch after punch. Each man delivering those hard rights to the face of their opponent. Black now from behind. Look at this half. Nelson over the back. Dropping him right onto his head. What's he doing here? Jumping outside the ring. Oh, he's getting right back in. And they meet in the center of the ring. Jason Jones going right after the headlock. And he's pulling him, bringing him back. Xander Black reverses with another belly-to-belly -belly shades of Jason Jones earlier in this matchup. Wow. Very nice move. Jones into the headlock. It, these guys don't have an advantage over one one or the other. It's just going to come down to the wire to see who can outlast the other, it looks like. Second drop toe hold 
down onto the mat. He's flipping him over and gonna work work hard on that arm. Man. And then an elbow drop across the chest. Nice move there by Jason Jones. Grabbing him by the neck. What a little modified uh, neck breaker there. And then a fist drop. These two men just battling out now. Back and forth. And Who the hell is this? Who the hell? What's he doing here? Who's he going after? Oh my god. He's going after Jason Jones. Oh, he's going after both men. Folks, that's the end of the show. We gotta go. Come back next week.